here is just such a that's a good mind to me. Sure. I mean, I've had it my whole Welcome life. back. <laughs> it's the three Bs. We've only just met, but we are starting a superhero conclave this morning. <laughs> it will seem like we're going to talk about the NAC barn party, and we are, but it's a very important moment when Benton, <laughs> Bender, and Burden come together. It's Birchy and Marcy. Good morning. Uh, good morning. Thank you for being here, Absolutely. friends. Thanks, Thanks for having us. So nice to meet you. You too. NAC rules. Totally. Hello. Yeah. Barn party. Yep. Fun time. Mm -hmm. Every year it's the biggest celebration that we have on campus and we fill up the barn with all kinds of different activities and lots of good food and dancing and everybody has a great time. It's in our 10th uh, year this year. 10. It gets a little yeah. bit bigger every year but it retains <laughs> the, the same family friendly funness that, <laughs> that it has every yeah. year so we're looking forward to it. And Bon Jovi, that's amazing. <laughs> I'm just kidding, you guys. That's, we're trying to keep that under wraps. <laughs> <laughs> Way to go, Tear. <laughs> well, there's always great music. Mm -hmm. I don't yeah. know who's playing who's this playing? year. So this year we have Cowboy Camp playing, and they played last year as well, um, which is great. This year we also have line dancing happening, which, which we put on hold for a year, and people got not happy about that. Oh, so really? we're bringing it back. <laughs> yep. Yeah. After dinner, everyone gets pretty excited about line dancing in the middle of the barn, and um, it's really fun for adults and kids. Yep. Yeah. Yes, kids, they're right there. Oh, yeah. Kids dance like crazy. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we have, the, the event is really kid-friendly. We have face painting, we have a petting zoo. Um, we have a mechanical bowl. <gasps> the mechanical bowl is, you know, is definitely the centerpiece. I've been wanting well. to separate my shoulder all spring, so this oh, works I've out heard, great. I mean, I've heard great things about that. It's really yeah. a fun recovery. <laughs> if you've safe. never separated your shoulder, you're missing out. It is yeah. No, safe it's safe, bowl. it's safe. Yep. I'm, being I'm being unfair. Yep. Yeah, it's, it's, not it's adjusted by uh, your perceived level of yep. competence on the bowl. So it can be as easy or as challenging as you want it to be. So there's like a there's like an Instagram speed where it goes really slow, but yep. you can look yeah, great. Yeah, and then you can repeat it over and over again, <laughs> right. just like the Instagram. That's right. Yeah. We yeah. never do it back in the old days, but a mechanical bowl is absolutely made for boomerang. A hundred percent. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we should be yes. a little bit serious about what good this mm -hmm. event is doing for your important organization, such an important part of our community here in Park City. Talk about what you guys, what the organization gets yeah, out of the of course. Party. The, the event does yeah. highlight and support the National Ability Center Equestrian Program. And um, as, as many of our locals know, the Equestrian Program is kind of the centerpiece is very visible on our campus and also out in the Round Valley Trail System. We are out there at least six days a week trail riding and sharing that space. Um, we have three different programs and then an equestrian program. We have adaptive riding, which is skill-based equestrian lessons with adaptations for each individual's physical or cognitive needs. We have hippotherapy, which is a medical treatment utilizing the movement of the horse. And then wow. we also have an unmounted program called equine assisted learning, which helps with team building and communication, um, interacting with the horse's nonverbal language. And, and what a lovely and important thing that not everyone can necessarily climb on the back of this majestic animal and go for a ride, but that doesn't mean that there aren't therapeutic benefits to just being exactly. around the animals. Yeah, therapeutic benefits is the key. <clears throat> Even for our programs that are not specifically therapy, just like for any of us, if we were gonna go ride a horse, um, unless somebody has a scary experience, most often we, we find peace, we, get relaxed, we find a connection, and for, for us, we can help facilitate that connection for individuals that might not otherwise come in contact with horses or have the opportunity to ride them. That's so lovely. Yeah. That's it's pretty just awesome. really cool. Yeah. Must be a lovely thing to get to spend your days around this kind of an environment. Oh, for sure. We get to see little miracles every day. I mean, everyone has their own kind of personal goals and personal best and um, to be able to get to 
to help people find that is, is really an honor. And it's really cool. Y'all do so many programs. Mm -hmm. I mean, of course, it's always a, a blast to come down the hill at the end of a day of skiing or snowboarding and see the crews outside of the, yeah. the NAC over at Park City and, and introducing so many folks to, to skiing and snowboarding and just having, likewise, the experience of being on the mm -hmm. snow. What's the next year for NAC bring? What are your... Yeah. What are your kind of goals or what are you all excited about in the in the next year for the National Ability Center? Well, it has been a huge, <laughs> a huge few years for us um, between joining up with Splore, which is was another um, adaptive organization based out of Salt Lake and Moab. So now we have a much farther reach with the National Ability Center to um, cover river rafting and so kind of all different offsite programs. We're much more mobile now, but we also are gearing up for breaking ground for our expansion. And so we are gonna be making some announcements about that process at the barn party as well. Is that accurate? That is accurate. Okay. <laughs> That's exciting. Yeah. I'm, I'm yeah. resisting the urge to push for more details because well, you are gonna it's have to come to the kind barn party. of the thing, yes, yes, absolutely. <laughs> yeah. So cool, yeah. I've, I've been to the barn party before, it's a ton of fun, mm -hmm. and of course, as we say all the time, we are richer as a community for the presence of your amazing organization and for the, the efforts that you all make to Thank welcome you. people into this community. Thank it's you. Thanks, Terry. Super cool thing. There's still tickets left. Cool. Yes. Where should you go to get that info? You can get go to tickets. our website, mm -hmm. www.discoverNAC.org, and right there under events, there's a little button that says get tickets. Mm -hmm. Get tickets. Yep. Go line dancing. Yeah. Come and celebrate with us and learn more about who we are, what we're doing, and, and what's coming up in the what's next few years up? for us. That's yeah. exciting. It's a good way to kick off the summer. Mm hmm. Virgie and Marcy, yeah. thank you so much. Oh, so thank nice you. to meet Thanks, you. Terry. You too. And um, don't forget, uh, superhero meeting next Tuesday. Perfect. Perfect. Awesome. Got it. All right, we got that <laughs> taken care of. League of Justice, move over. It's the three B's. <laughs> All proceeds of our superhero activities go to the National Ability Center. DiscoverNAC.org this weekend, the barn party. You can hang out with these lovely ladies and so many more amazing humans who are a part of the NAC. Quick break, we'll be back with more.